Hey, welcome to this Windows channel. And today, as we do a, a video for the different questions that everybody asks, um, this is about Facebook app. Um, I've got some people that actually ask me um, if there's another way to sign in to Facebook, not just through the browser. So Facebook still works fine. You can go with Microsoft Edge or whatever browser you use and go on the web page directly. But there's a uh, app in Windows uh, Store that is quite good and quite interesting for Facebook. And if you have a touch device, of course, because of the bigger buttons, also helps you instead of, uh, for example, a um, browser that has small buttons that isn't always useful for um, page viewing on um, and especially going through different apps uh, or pages um, like Facebook on a touch device. So there's a app for that. You just go to the Microsoft Store, just type Facebook on the uh, search on the upper right and you'll see Facebook app with that big F, white F in a blue uh, tile. So you just have to install it. It is free. And once it is installed, well, you get a Facebook app. So here I'll bring it up, Facebook, and uh, Trusted Windows App Store Facebook app. So basically, uh, you have all the possibilities of um, any app in Facebook or any Facebook page, basically. Uh, on the left side, you've got everything from your name to the news feed to the friends, photos, everything you need to do, create groups. Uh, all the options are there. On the upper right, you still have the same options of the notifications, uh, private messages, and also your friends that are um, requesting. So it does look in part with um, the web page. Now, one of the problems that we had in Windows 8 was, OK, I got the app. I don't know how to log off. And that was really, really annoying because in Windows 8, you had to go into the charms bar to get the app and you know go into the bottom logout and so on in windows 10 it is a little simpler but it still needs probably a little bit of explaining you can log off by going into the hamburger menu on the upper left so that's where you need to check it out check the hamburger menu once you are in the hamburger menu here, you can see that there's app commands, search, share, and settings. And into the settings, you got logout. Now, I'll give you one here. Why isn't there a, just a big logout button somewhere on this app? Why do we have to go into settings? It's still complex to do that. Maybe not as much as knowing that you need to go into an, uh, a charms bar like in Windows 8, but still. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people will ask this also in Windows 10. So you go into the hamburger menu on the upper left, you go into settings, and here you've got all the information about the Facebook profile sync, the notifications, you have your account settings here, licenses, privacy, terms and policies, but you've got the log out button right there that you can click to log out of your Facebook account. And if somebody else wants to log in, then you'll be able to uh, have multiple people use the same Facebook app. So uh, that's pretty much the Facebook app. Uh, it works fine. I use it on my touch device mostly. Uh, I like it a lot. It works very well on a touch device and it still works well. But like I said, you know what? You can still go with the good old way of going to Facebook, which is using your favorite web browser. But at least you know that it's there. And now you know how to log out if you need to log out of your Facebook app. If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything you need to know, please ask. And um, if you have a feature you'd like me to make a video, uh, please ask. Be patient. I've got a lot of requests, and they are coming slowly. So, um, you know, in the coming days and weeks, we'll be posting lots of um, demands people have been having about uh, different options and different things about windows and different programs so thank you for watching and hope to see you soon bye bye